Your house got negative energy. Your friends are negative. That's why you ain't happy. Because everything around you is a direct reflection of who you are. God sends us bold signs and wonders and tells us to change our environment and our surroundings so that we can reach the ultimate level of being blessed. Get rid of things, people, and situations, relationships, friendships, surroundings. Deciding that you love yourself enough to no longer walk in the direction of pain. If you keep being a victim, if you keep letting losing happen to you, if you keep letting people do you and treat you any kind of way, it's going to become a culture. It's necessary that you get the energy drainers out of your life. People who don't want anything. People who are not striving. People who are not challenging themselves. People who aren't growing. People who have stopped dreaming. It's necessary that you align yourself with people that attract people into your business. Who are hungry. People who are unstoppable and unreasonable. People who are refusing to leave life just as it is. If you run around with losers, you will end up a loser. It's necessary that you get the losers out of your life if you want to live your dream. want to go from average to phenomenal you got to start hanging around phenomenal people so what i did was from the people around me my mentors eddie murphy chris rock Pryor, yeah. um who are all on the walls all on the walls yeah all on the walls so you surround uh, yourself with I that surra i surround myself with a constant reminder of who's great constantly i come down these steps every day i look at richard oh he's great i see eddie he was great I see Chris Rock, he was great. I, it's a constant reminder. What am I trying to achieve? I want to be great. So yeah. that motivates me. So the thing that separates me is my drive. My drive is other people's success.